Good morning, you guys. What is our first vlog of 2022? I can't believe it. Today is Thursday, the 6th of January. I nearly said another month. I don't know what I was going to say there. And look at Tilly. <laughs> Doesn't she look cute there? Yeah, so today is a vlog. I'm not actually got much to do today. It's going to be a home vlog. I feel like all my vlogs are at home, anyways. But, anyways, let's put you guys up here. Yeah. Guys, yeah, so today is a vlog. Um, I'm not really going to be doing much. My plan today, okay, let's see what the time is first of all. It's 9.06. Um, I've just had the electrician come over to change the light in, in my living room because I've got like three spotlights around and I've got like one main light but that spot um the spotlights were like rusty inside so they had to um like change the I'm not an electrician you guys know what I mean change the thing inside that the bulb goes into so that's all set but annoying thing is is that um there's three lights like I said but two of them are white and one of them is like a warm yellow I know it's a small thing but those things just wind me up <laughs> so I think he said I called the guy back so he said um like during the week um next week he will drop off a white bulb for me so that they all can be matching because that is very annoying um does anything like that like annoy you guys like i know that might be like something silly like for me obviously i've just moved into this place if you guys are watching this for the first time i just moved into this place so there you were know, little things like the the post box on the inside of the apartment didn't have like a, a cover on it so i called them to <laughs> put a cover on that and also i called them to put like um a cover on the keyhole where you put your key through on the outside like for me like you're paying your rent you want to feel like you're getting your money's worth and like those things just make me feel like disorientated i know that just sounds so weird but comment comment down below if you are literally the same Anyway, enough rambling on about the maintenance work in this house. How are you guys? What are you guys up to? How has the week been so far? I'm so happy. Tomorrow is Friday. Um, yeah, I don't know why I'm talking so fast. I need a coffee. I think that's what it is. You know when like you haven't, if you're a coffee drinker and you haven't had a coffee, you get all like, Ooh, you need a coffee. <laughs> so that is how I am now. Guys, I have a new coffee maker. So I want to show you guys. So this is my new coffee maker. I got it like, um, what are we in now? January. So I got it in November, I think late November um an espresso it's a really really nice i'll show you the coffee pods these are the coffee pods that go inside so it's like the new i think it's called like the new age one i don't know so you've got like the new the um like the main espresso coffee machine which like takes like the little pods um which is more accessible i'm thinking mm. this was gifted to me by a friend so you know i can't complain i'm very grateful but for a late birthday present that was actually uh, my birthday was in november um i was gonna say no i hate when i'm trying to get so much information out at once and then i just get confused what i was gonna say yeah so yeah it was gifted to me for a late birthday present so like there's a main nespresso coffee machine that uh, like is more generic and more common what takes the little coffee pods and things you can get all of those coffee pods in the supermarket but obviously this new sort of age one um takes these ones that are sort of round and stuff so you have to order them you can get them on amazon but it's actually it costs less to to order them off the nespresso website and they literally came the next day i was so shocked considering i ordered them on a bank holiday so if you've got an espresso machine order them off the website because they were like 55p each depending on like what um what coffee you want i think the most um you, you pay for like one coffee pod was like 70p i think or 65p um but the only catch is is that you have to have like a minimum order of 50 coffee pods so um with the, i think i got colombian and like some other ones so everything came up to 27 pounds which is quite good and a lot of the time i do split like one coffee pod into two cups of coffees because they are quite large they're like i think they're like 250 ml yeah they're 250 ml let's show you guys 
<laughs> 250 mils so yeah i usually just split them into like two coffees so sometimes i'll have one in the morning and one in the afternoon and then sometimes i'll add a little bit of hot water because i find that strong coffee does trigger my anxiety a little bit so i try not to drink too much coffee and i try not to have coffee that is too strong so yeah enough of that coffee um what else let me show you guys the milk actually not enough back one. let me show you the milk that i've been having guys i love this oatly milk and um, my brother actually introduced me to this milk and it's so good like it literally tastes like cow's milk but obviously it's not cow's milk and i get the barista barista edition so when you put it in your coffee it doesn't um it doesn't curdle and it's just really really nice in the coffee but yeah enough about coffee now so i'm actually just going to sorry my face i just can see my face is like so darker than my chest <laughs> anyways i'm gonna make coffee tilly is over there do you want to see her let's show you tilly <laughs> so yeah that's tilly um literally i am gonna just make the coffee um then probably tidy up and then i want to take tilly for a walk today because i don't really have much to do um so i'm thinking just take her for a walk even though she does not walk guys tilly does not to walk <laughs> the vet told me like um if i'm firm with her she will walk but a lot of the times i put her down on the ground she'll walk for like 30 seconds and then afterwards it's like mommy pick me up mommy pick me up and she's jumping up at me so yeah um i'm not too bothered like um she's still only five months does anybody know what like dog years are like how old is five months in dog years like i don't know well it's not even a year yet but you know what i mean how old is dog years to human years because i've been trying to google it but everything is just like mismatch information i'm just so confused if anybody knows what how many dog years are to human years comment down below to let me know because your girl needs to know so i can know how old my puppy is and like i said she's five months um as it stands she was born july 26 <laughs> i had to think about it july 26 she was born um so yeah i'm gonna actually just have my coffee now because your girl's rumbling because um i need my coffee so i will get back to you guys when something more excited is happening hey guys it is currently 3 19 3 19 and literally just been chilling out today um it is freezing guys let me show you how cold it is it is literally six degrees in london and earlier on it was like two so it's like super cold i'm gonna give tilly some treats i like to give her some treats around this time of day this is what she has she has these or she has has these which are like poppy treats like almost like natural so she has those because i feel like these are more like biscuity type thing even though they're like meat flavored um but yeah let me show you guys i need to like teach her some more tricks because i feel like she doesn't know many <sighs> let's see this is what she does wait till he sit Sit, sit, good girl, Tilly. Well done, good girl. Hmm. Sit, 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 good girl. Oops. She literally loves her treats, guys. Um, so I give, I literally count them. I give her like four. I know they say like uh, they can't really put on too much weight when they're puppies because they like quite active but I still don't want to overfeed her. Good girl Tilly. Is it nice? 
yes i'm probably gonna tidy up because i was meant to do that earlier on but i was trying to wait in for a package which i don't know if i missed it or what happened <sighs> because there's no buzzing system where i live which is highly annoying so yeah i'm gonna tidy up and do what i was meant to do earlier on i swear every time i pick the camera up i'm in the kitchen <laughs> <laughs> I promise you guys like I literally do not spend the whole day in the kitchen but it's afternoon it's nearly the evening for something um yeah I just had a little nap because I was so tired I know I said like I had things to do I'm finding it so hard sorry guys <clears throat> to be like motivated um but anyways I got my pretty little thing package it came the day so you guys will be getting some type of haul soon i think saturday i'm gonna upload yeah saturday i'll be um back to uploading my hauls for you guys and i feel like i want to do like more of styling videos um where like i style like a whole outfit because i feel like that gives you more of an insight to like what you can buy from like one whole website and maybe i might do some videos where i would do like collective hauls so like buy something from shein buy something from pretty little thing buy something from boohoo and like put those outfits together i don't know what you guys think sorry i'm just messing around with the viewfinder <laughs> but yeah um i'm actually gonna tidy up now i find it best to like tidy up when um i put like some music on and it's so cold so i feel like if i move around tidy up move around i'll be warm like my heating is on the highest temperature and i'm so happy in this place i have the gas central heating in my old apartment i really want to put the camera down my old apartment i literally had um all electric heaters the whole building was electric so here i have a gas stove um like i said i have um gas central heating so that is really good i'm happy it's much much warmer in here um but it's still just really freezing i don't understand earlier on it was like two degrees it didn't feel as cold as what it feels now and now it's like five six degrees i think there's something about when it's like really early and it's getting like late i'm so sorry for the lighting but this is a vlog guys so you know the lighting might be a bit crap here and there um yeah i'm gonna try and upload this a vlog today because I just want to you know make sure I'm getting some content out there for you guys I know a lot of you guys are subscribed for the try and hauls but they are coming back soon guys because you know how to get like get the orders in and stuff like that um yeah so those are going to be definitely coming back but obviously I just want to be giving you guys raw content as well like I feel like my try and hauls are more like to do like i've done up like all my makeup's like all done hair pretty whatever um whereas like my vlogs and like everyday videos i feel like i want them to be more laid back and maybe i want to like maybe start picking some subjects to talk about as well i think that would be good as well i don't want my channel just to be based upon just fashion because i feel like there's more to me than just you know what i'm wearing <laughs> i feel like there's more to us as, as a community than you know the clothes that we wear and a lot of you guys we do chat about like usual things in the comments so yes let me stop rambling on i think i don't know what i'm gonna have i think i've got a little bit of coffee left from earlier on so i'm gonna have some coffee um and yeah kitchen's slightly messy <laughs> dishes in the sink stove is a mess so I'm going to have some more coffee, finish the things in my bedroom because I'm determined like for this weekend to have everything put out. Like there's just, you know when you move and there's those, like you unpack everything and there's just little bags of random crap that you just feel like, do I just throw this bag away? But then there'll be that one moment you'll be like, where is that little thing? And then you'll remember you threw away that random bag and it was probably in there. So I, I'm, I feel like I've got like slight what do they call it hoarding tendencies like i do hoard some things so i've just got like maybe like two three random bags that i need to unpack so i'm determined to clear my dressing table which has loads of random things on it and clear those like two random bags and then i'm basically unpacked i'm basically unpacked um and yeah so 
I'm gonna get on with that guys and I'll probably get back to you soon. So here we are again guys in the kitchen and I'm making dinner. I'm making an omelette. Um, I've got some spring onion hair. I've also got a red bell pepper which I'm gonna include. I hope the camera, the lighting is really not good in here guys. Um, I've also got these mushrooms that I need to eat. So I'm gonna like chop these up and put them in the omelette too. And then your girl loves spicy stuff. So I've also got a scotch bonnet pepper, which I'm gonna add to it. And I'm gonna put you guys here and maybe we can just talk whilst I'm making this. This vlog is kind of gonna go up quite late. I just realized I say like a lot, like, um, I'm gonna do this, like, um, and like, so I'm so sorry for that. <laughs> I know I'm probably gonna have a comment that is gonna say, I'm gonna really say it again, that's gonna say, how many times is she gonna say like? Like, seriously? <laughs> I say it so much, but, um, you know, sometimes you don't realize you say something until someone tells you, like, hey, you say this, this word a lot. And obviously my one is like, like, like. So I'm going to be more conscious of that because I know when I watch videos myself and the person just keeps on saying a certain word a lot, it's like a little bit annoying. <laughs> so I'm literally, I literally don't feel like eating this evening. So... But I'm gonna eat anyways because I need to take my, my vitamins and stuff. So I know it's important. I literally had a very heavy meal around three actually. Around three o'clock. And what are we now? It is nearly eight. So I had it around three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, five hours. Yeah, my mass is not good at to use my fingers. <laughs> <laughs> five hours ago so I know that I'm getting hungry because I'm like hmm what can I snack on and I'm trying to be I mentioned it in one of my other videos but like I'm trying to be healthy more healthy this year like I'm not trying to say I said it again oh my gosh I'm not trying to say that I don't want to lose weight but it's not like a massive priority to me because I don't want to put that pressure on myself to lose weight if I lose it whilst eating healthy, fine. But if I don't, then whatever. <laughs> I don't care. <laughs> okay, I don't want to say I don't care, but you know, it's not a priority. Let's just put it that way. It's not a priority, guys. I'm just cutting up all these vegetables. Go in. I wanted to try and like see if I can do like you know when you. I said it again. So sorry guys, I'm trying, okay, I was trying. <laughs> At least I'm conscious of it, yeah? I know I'm doing it. I wanted to try and make an omelette, like, do they call it? I don't know if it's called an omelette, but anyway, basically bake it in the oven. But I don't know how it's gonna turn out. Should I try it? I wanna try it. Sometimes it's nice to like try new things. These mushrooms, um, they're always best best before so it's not too bad um if i eat them today i think do you guys like mushrooms it, sometimes when i think about the fact that a mushroom is a fungi i'm like <laughs> i feel like <laughs> oh gosh, it's not gonna work guys okay listen yeah i'm gonna try for the next video to not say it. Yeah, so as I was saying, when I think about the fact that a mushroom is an actual fungi, I'm like, ew eating fungi <laughs> but mushrooms are good i like the texture of them and i think for people that like vegan and stuff like that it's really good for them because it has like um 
said it again, didn't I? It has a meaty sort of texture for them. So they use it sort of as like a meat um, substitute type thing. What did you guys have for dinner? I don't know if all these black bits, I should just be taking them off. So basically, I have, yeah, this is a really awkward angle. <laughs> but yeah, basically, I just tipped it all over the floor. I just whisked up the eggs, put, added the like the vegetables in it, seasoned it. So that's all done. I just want to wipe that up before Tilly gets to it because you know how puppies are. They literally lick, eat everything they possibly can. So let's just make sure that's all out of the way is that alright Tilly? so I have no particular recipe for this like I've never done it before sorry for Tilly's squeaky toy I bought her this squeaky ball the other day and it squeaks everywhere on the ball so as soon as you like pick it up or it even like just drops on the floor it squeaks so sorry for that <laughs> now like I said, I don't have any particular recipe for it, um, but I've got this little dish that was in this house when I moved in, so I'm going to steal it and use it, um, and I'm going to put some, I'm going to put some olive oil in the bottom because obviously I don't want it to stick to the pan. I'm going to put like a generous helping. <laughs> Generous helping of olive oil. That's the only thing about when you do oven stuff. Sometimes things just really stick to the, the pan. Dishes and stuff. And then I'm just going to add it in here. And put it in the oven. I don't think it's going to take too long because it's eggs. So. Oh my god, it's too much. This looks a lot. Ever feel like you know when you're hungry but you're not hungry I hate that feeling so this is what it looks like very healthy and juicy and now I'm going to add it put it in the oven um, I feel like I want to put it on something just in case it drips so at least it's not going to make a big mess So I feel like I should have preheated the oven because now we're going to have to wait for it to heat up. But that's fine. It gives me a chance to pack away all of this, this mess. Um, and then I'm going to sit down. I'm super tired. I don't even feel like I've done loads today, but I'm just so tired. But I woke up quite early. I think that's what it is. And next week, like, I've been, I feel like my eating has have been quite good. Like I've been relatively healthy this week. But my bedtimes have been horrendous. Like, I go to bed at like 1 a.m., 2 a.m., uh, 1.30 a.m. The earliest I think I been, went to bed this week was around 11.30. So I really need to work on going to bed at a decent time. I'm going to tidy up the kitchen, wait for this omelette to cook. I'm feeling like if I should have some toast with it, so any carbohydrates, well... I don't know if I will because I've had quite a lot of carbs today. <laughs> I'm trying to cut back on my carbs because, you know, carbs turn into sugar. So I'm trying to cut down on sugar. So I need to cut down on carbs. But I might just have one piece of bread. One piece of bread. But I'm really curious to see how this is going to turn out. If it turns out good, then it's like something that I'm going to definitely be doing, um, you know, as, 
as a meal. I was gonna say something, but I totally forgot. I caught Tilly biting my glasses, guys. Like, she's literally chewed one of the ends. So annoying. <sighs> Tilly is really sneaky. Like, whenever she goes off and she's really quiet and I can't see her, I know she's got something that she shouldn't have. Guys, that is like the 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 whole thing of having a puppy. Like you have to really really watch them, or they will just destroy everything. So, like I said, I'm gonna tidy up this mess, tidy up the kitchen, so that when I have my omelet, oh, I feel my appetite opens because right now I don't really feel that hungry. So, I'm gonna tidy up this mess and then, um, yeah, I'll be back to show you my omelet and probably close the vlog because I want to upload it tonight. So you guys got a vlog tonight. So, I'll see you soon. Okay, guys. So, I've just taken the omelette slash egg out of the oven. Oh, my God, guys. <laughs> I've literally been cooking it for, I would say, about 45 minutes. I don't know if the oven was not up high enough or what. But anyways, I will turn the camera on and show you guys what it looks like. This is what it looks like. Sorry, the camera's not really... Lighting is not really giving, you know, aesthetic vibes. And it doesn't look that appetizing. But yeah, you do have to try things in. Yeah, you do have to try things in life. So that was my egg made in the oven. That's what I can call it. I'm going to eat this and, you know, have a shower. I was going to have a bath. I feel too lazy to get in the bath right now. Um, But, yeah. So I want to have this and I think I'm going to wrap up this vlog here. Hopefully you guys will see me tomorrow. If not, definitely Saturday when I do my train haul. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoy the rest of your week and I'll see you soon.